I'm Lindell Wigginson. I'm back in Halifax, Nova Scotia. I'm here working and I'm here working to, to earn a contract. Uh, I felt I had a great year. We had a good team overall. Um, obviously, it got cut short due to the COVID-19, uh, but I felt I had a great year. Um, just keep improving my game and getting better and uh, waiting on my opportunity. Obviously, just my mindset going in the game, just you know, each and every day, uh, building that mindset to you know, try to be the best player on the floor. And um, you know, what I gained uh, playing in the G League is just um, my pick and roll game, um, finishing at the rim, obviously my ball handling, and um, just making shots at a consistent rate. Uh, yeah, I mean, it feels good, obviously, to you know, be one of the main guys you know, on the team and you know, obviously to get exposure from uh, the social media part. Uh, it feels great, but you know, like I said, I'm just trying to come in and be the, like, be the best player I can be. And, um, I think, it, I think it's great, uh, great for me. Obviously, it's great for the team, too, to get exposure. But um, yeah, most importantly, it's, it's a team effort. Obviously, you know, being being on the biggest stage, it's a lot of challenges as a rookie. Um, so I would say the biggest thing is to just to uh, be a sponge, soak everything up. Um, my time at you know the Timberwolves training camp was, was amazing because I got to you know, soak up things from guys like Andrew Wiggins, Carl Towns, um, Rob Covington, um, you know, guys like that. So. Uh, it was amazing for me to just, you know, learn from those guys and, you know, soak everything up and you know, just to be a sponge. And obviously at the point guard position, that's the, that's the hardest position in the NBA. So um, just going out there, you know, each and every night with the, with the mindset to, you know, just try to be the best you you can be. And um, that's what I try to do. Due to the COVID stuff, you know, I wasn't in the gym or anything like that. Obviously my decision to go over there is because I just wanted to stay in shape. I think it went good. Um, uh, we made the playoffs. Obviously, we, uh, we lost first first round of the playoffs, but um, I think it went good. It, it helped me, you know, gain some European experience. Obviously, I had a little European experience playing with Team Canada, but uh, I felt it was good, and um, you know, it just made me a better player. I got a goal, and I I want to stick to that goal. Obviously, play at the highest level and play in the NBA, um, but also, you know, taking that opportunity to play overseas, you just gain gaining more experience. Uh, and learning from you know a lot of older guys over there. A lot of older guys they got experience. You know some guys have played in the NBA before and you know know what it takes to, to get there and, and play there for a long time. So um, obviously for me it's just to keep going, just to keep playing and um, you know keep keep gaining gaining more more and more experience. And uh, you know I feel like I'm doing that. Uh, so that's why I say to the youth. My goal for this coming season is to you know earn an NBA contract, and um, that's what I'm working towards.